never heard of it. Now? We're live. Now. We're starting. I wish I had now. like a, a paper thing to jump through. We're live. <laughs> <laughs> just I have mean, like a blanket in front of you or something and drop yeah, it. Yeah. I, I was going to say you could just hold a piece of paper in your hands and like rip it in half. <laughs> <laughs> well, just hold it really close to the camera so it fills the oh, whole frame. Yes. Yeah. Then, I'm afraid my, we'll go my from fork there. is... My fork is oh, so yeah. Well, it doesn't matter because it's not auto focus. Oh, that's true. Yes. So, yes. And it's, it's all manual focus. <laughs> like a true <laughs> photographer would. Manual focus. Yeah, Joey's like, manual I'm white focus. balancing my webcam. <laughs> <laughs> it's very important. Uh, well, welcome to episode 17. 17 weeks of this. No, it's, it's Jesus. Jesus. Actually, it, hurt, it hurt, hurts my teeth to say that. <laughs> <laughs> Coming out of my mouth, it hurts. (laughs) (laughs) All of Uh, the expensive dentistry that our t-shirt sales have been going to. I know, yeah. Yeah. All for naught. I'm getting my teeth de-whitened. Because I don't want them to be so bright. (laughs) (laughs) It's it's affecting the white balance. Exactly, yeah. yeah. It's true. Throw it off the forecast. They put like a little, one of those little things that they put the the foamy fluoride in. Except it's full of like coffee. Yeah, it just sits there for like an and hour. And red wine. Yeah. It's like the activated charcoal, but it doesn't go away. Yeah. <laughs> Gross. Do I need to wash this off? No, no, of course not. You just leave it there. Yeah. <laughs> you never have to brush your teeth again. Exactly. That'll be one million dollars. <laughs> um, so buy our shirts to uh-huh. fuel that. Uh, yeah. <laughs> um, Good segue. Let's reveal our Dromax shirt. I love my Dromax. If you're a fan of RC Cola, like I know our <laughs> yep. friend friend of the show, Alfred Hitchcock is. Alfred Hitchcock, mm-hmm. yes. He Very loves RC Cola. I wish he was still alive so we could tell him our <laughs> pathetic Alfred Hitchcock joke. <laughs> we used to have a book. We used to have like a little book. We did. Black we book. had a notebook. Yeah, that filled had all. With yeah, filled, jokes. Literally filled with <laughs> Alfred Hitchcock. To the brim. Yeah, it was brimming with jokes. <laughs> uh, R.I.P. Uh, so so, uh, both your... Alfred Hitchcock and the notebook. Yeah. <laughs> and Royal Crown Cola. I don't know if it exists anymore. Yeah. I don't know. I've never. Seen, I mean, I've seen Tab at the store, but I've never seen. I'm. Um, well, let's see. Our, RC Cola does. is like in the same section as like Fago, and like <laughs> yeah. and like Doctor Thunder. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> all the uh, all the off brands. Professor Salt. Uh, <laughs> RC PhD. Cola is is <laughs> is, is like Doctor Salt PhD. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Um, still, RC Cola is sold in 67 countries around the world, and it remains a top seller in the Philippines. Oh, oh. interesting. There you go. That was in an article from July 31st, 2020. Wow. So if you're watching from the Philippines, and I know you are, mm-hmm. yes, grab the shirt. People will think, hey, is that an RC Cola shirt? And you'll say, no, it's not even close. No. And they'll say, sorry. <laughs> and then just keep talking. <laughs> 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 they won't ask you where you got it. They're not interested in the beating of it. No. no. Uh, all our shirts are like are like this. Like you see it and you're like, huh. And then you're like, what? Wait. It's like, because yeah, it looks literally. like something else, but yeah. it's not. Well, any Anytime I've worn I, either of the shirts, the, it's scream time and no, when I've worn them to work, people just read the shirt back to me. So like, <laughs> I'll be at work and, and like, like. My coworkers, like, I'll walk past one of my coworkers and they just go, it's scream time. And I'm like, yeah, I know. But they don't yeah. ask me what it means or what it's from or anything. <laughs> <laughs> they just read it to me. Oh, my God. Hey, there and you same- are. Do I know you? No, but that's where you are. You're there. <laughs> like, yeah. It's literally yeah. the same. Oh my same God. with the no shirt. They just go, no. I'm like, what? Yes. This, why? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I know. <laughs> you should just go, so you if, go. You should go. What? Why is that funny? No. What? No, what? I what, don't what, what? What do you mean? No, what do you mean? Uh, this is really frustrating. I, I what would, do you mean? 
I would prefer it if people saw my It's Scream Time shirt and just screamed at me. <laughs> that would be better. Now imagine that happens and you're like the only person on the subway. There's oh like my one god. Other guy in the, in the car with you. <laughs> well, then it becomes pee time because. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. So buy our shirts if you want people to have horrible, uncomfortable, stupid interactions. (laughs) You too. There you go. Um, and check Perfect. out check out our new our new website. Well, it's not a new website, but it's a new URL. Never heard of it. Yes. Dot biz. Dot yes. biz. Never heard of it. Dot biz. Because we're in the biz <laughs> of making you not laugh. I've always wanted a dot biz URL. Oh, I now now is your chance. We should start a Too hosting we- site. Now's your chance to own a part of history. Own a dot biz. <laughs> URLs dot biz. That's, that's gonna be our website. <laughs> I'm sad that we couldn't get like never heard of it dot edu or something. dot gov dot dot like dot ny dot gov like a state's yeah. government website. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wait, can we get can we get is is like is dot it for like Italy? Can we get never? Heard I was of gonna of say it? never heard oh, of dot it. Oh, that's a good. I was one. gonna okay. say that earlier. I'll check. Wait, then, what's what's the URL? Well, you better for do it next- before you upload this because somebody else is gonna steal oh, it before you get a oh, chance. Oh yeah. Well, don't forget, <laughs> we're, this is live. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Up- uh, we already got it. Sorry. Um, <laughs> shit. I was gonna say what's coming what's soon. The, it's already here. <laughs> what's the website ending for uh, websites in Andorra? Because all of our biggest oh, fans are right. there. Yes, that's so. true. <laughs> But yeah, when we were talking about it earlier, I was going to suggest never heard of dot it. But then I was like, is that Italy? Is that like a weird, so yeah. weird? I think, I, I don't think it matters. I think other, yeah. other websites have done that. They use that as like a. And, and also, just like Andorra, our logo is very close to the flag of Italy. It's red, green, and blue. That's true. So we just need that white. Yeah. Just like France also. <laughs> That's true. Yeah. Because they're red, white, and blue. Mm-hmm. All right. Um, hey, anyway, we have a movie. Are we going to watch, watch a movie or? No, 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 no. <laughs> no, please, God, no. Not, not this week. week. We're, eight, we're eight minutes in and we're done. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome. You can call this one. All right, we're going to watch a movie right now we've never heard of. Yes. And my keyboard doesn't work. Cool. Oh, that's good. So, there we go. Maybe we're, maybe we're not going to watch a movie. <laughs> Dan's like, yes. <laughs> Uh, I'm like I'm like craving a kind of heard of it only because there's so many good ones that we didn't watch. I can't wait to watch mm, one yes. of those. Mm-hmm. Uh, all of the miss, all of the I write Craigslist missed connections to all the movies that we don't get to watch. <laughs> <laughs> because I I wish so much to experience them. Is there a, is there a Facebook missed connections now that everybody's moved to Facebook Marketplace? Oh, I oh bet. yes. I can start one <laughs> if you'd like. Uh, I feel like we've seen. I think I feel like we've done this list before. Like we've. we've I think so too. One. I'm trying to find a list that we mm. we've never heard of. Wow. <laughs> and that's the show. Yeah. We found it. That's yeah, it. We found it. Yay! And all Thank we can you do all is for scroll through us. the list and look at all the names of the movies, and then we're done. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, okay. How about? Doom Asylum, 1987. Oh. Legendado. The Legend of Uh-oh. Doom Asylum. Uh, a horribly disfigured lawyer, wrongfully pronounced dead after a terrible car accident, is taken to an asylum for dissection. That's not where that happens. Only to come, <laughs> <laughs> only to come back to life and make the asylum his killing ground. I'm imagining that he gets into a car crash and then he just he says the word dead wrong. He mispronounces it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Wrongfully pronounced dead. He's Maybe like, he doctor, did. They're like, oh my god, he's crazy. Take him to the asylum. <laughs> yeah. Doctor, am I brain? Am I dead? <laughs> <laughs> oh, how about this one? Anthropophagus. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Is that is that a name from Gentleman Broncos? <laughs> Wait, anthropophagus. <laughs> um, this says, uh, t- 
tourists become stranded on an island and are stalked by a gruesome killer that slaughtered the island's former inhabitants. Yeah. The the cover makes it look interest like cool. Yeah. Mm. Uh, Doctor Wolfula's blood cult. <laughs> this one says live stream. I wonder if it's also people watching it like us. I tried to look up Dr. Wolfila's blood cult and I spelled blood with four O's. Oh. <laughs> blood cult. <laughs> How about this one? Blood song. <laughs> Wait, um, uh, Dr. Wolfila, uh, Dr. Wolfila appears to be some sort of like Commander USA type situation. Uh, um, okay. But blood cult is female students at a quiet midwestern college are being killed and their body parts used for blood sacrifices mm. um blood mm. song mm-hmm. is that what you said mm-hmm. um, a high school student is cornered in a lumber yard by a hatchet <laughs> killer who plays the flute <laughs> <laughs> that's the one that's it it's blood song baby <clears throat> Oh my god. Wow. Wait a second. And the 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 hatchet killer who plays the flute is played by Frankie Avalon. What? What? <laughs> Why? What? I was gonna say, is it I... uh is it Kenny G? Whoa. <laughs> Blood song. Blood song. I, I doubt though that any of the music will be as good as Rock Invasion. <laughs> I know. What is it with us and and music related movies? They're just much better. Yeah. Oh. That's <laughs> well, design <laughs> <the> better. <laughs> All right, ladies well, and I mean, gentlemen. Black Roses and uh, Rock and Roll Nightmare are both in the top five. That's yeah. true. So. Throw cellos of madness. What did that say? The quality was so bad. Cello, All state, you've got a face. Allstate All State State. Film Company. <laughs> with Allstate, you're in good hands. <laughs> Not with this movie, though. The music that was Uh-oh. banging. Yes. <gasps> yeah, why is there no flute? Yeah. <laughs> Richard Jekyll. Dane Cook. <laughs> and Lenny Montana as Scrumpler. <laughs> Skipper, maybe? Yeah. Uh, and Frankie Avalon as Food. <laughs> With a PH. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the best part is that his he's the murderer, and it's like, but his name, his character's name is just Paul. <laughs> Paul? That's it. Okay. Just Paul. Beautiful. Beautiful. I can't believe there Beautiful. was an original story on this. Like if it's I based know. on another piece, uh, another medium. <laughs> Were you going to say a piece of shit? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was based on a smaller piece of shit, and they just turned it into a much okay. bigger, <laughs> steamier piece of shit. Wait, th- this says... Um, the... Wikipedia says Blood Song, also known as Dream Slayer. Oh, that's really close to Dream Warrior, the Nightmare on Elm yeah. Street movie. Yeah. Which had its own song by Dokken, if you remember that. Dream Warrior. It's like a real 80s. Uh, oh. We'll watch it afterwards if we have time. Yes. <laughs> Only if we have time, though. We're on a strict schedule. And we will not have time. <laughs> And this well, time. we don't have time. <laughs> this movie was seized and confiscated in the UK under Section 3 of the Obscene Publications Act during the Video Nasty Panic. Mm. <gasps> Video Nasty. Video Nasties. Our favorite. Well, when I say favorite. <laughs> <laughs> Whoop. Keep the change. Oh. Have a nice night. My old stomping ground. Yeah, have a nice night too. Uh-oh. <laughs> I recognize that black alley. Hey, buddy. 
that gun away. Oh Let me God. check. Please, please. I didn't know. No, no. Ah! What? What? They're watching something on the television. <laughs> oh, okay. No. Nope. The most I intense. I believe you. The most intense episode of Dallas. <laughs> <laughs> A virtual reality episode. <laughs> <laughs> And then he oh. starts playing the flute. <laughs> and he goes... <laughs> <laughs> what is he oh, holding? The flute. A gingerbread uh, man. <laughs> thought it was something he fished out of the toilet. <laughs> I've just experienced the greatest trauma a child could experience. Time to play the recorder. Hot cross buns. <laughs> <laughs> We're off to a great start. Mm -hmm. Like, where was Frankie Avalon in his career that he was like, I gotta do this movie, or oh my gonna, God, the bank please. is gonna seize everything? <laughs> He's like, I owe a lot of people a lot of money. <laughs> yeah. He always has like a sniper's red dot on him somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> Well, he released his last album in 1962, so that's where he was at wow. 20 years later. Okay. Uh. Uh. What? What? What is happening? Dun 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 dun. Dun 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 dun. Da da da. The with the flute. Da 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 da. But it's like that. It's like that. Like recorder, uh, uh, Jurassic Park. Yeah, thing, yeah. Thing. yeah. Or it's like really poorly played. Are you in here? Yeah. You're not supposed to be playing that flute. Do 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 No, I'm being strangled by a flute. Oh no! <laughs> no, my windpipe. Oh, oh, I hope there's a bunch of puns like that. I believe I had a hat. <laughs> <laughs> May I take your hat, sir? What would be great is if the he had two pipes and they were tied together like nunchucks. And he was oh, like, Oh, that would be awesome. <laughs> 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 well, no, when he's like flipping them around, they would just like play a song because the wind, oh, that's right. the wind is yes. moving through yeah, them. That's right. Yeah. Hot cross buns. <laughs> that's all he knows. <laughs> this is a very reminiscent of like Halloween. Yeah. Where like he went away to an institution and then he gets out. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's so. It's nice that the shoe is already on there. Frank, How easy. To Ralph today yeah. by that job but then you have to match that shoe to every outfit. I know. <laughs> that's true. Get to the like clogs again. <laughs> that's so last year. <laughs> God, you're running late. Running late. <laughs> <laughs> Why'd you get up earlier? This, this again? Come on, you better eat. You missed the bus. I'm hungry. Wait, you don't, don't eat to, to, to catch the bus. Maybe I don't <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You better eat or you'll miss the bus. 
What? <laughs> the bus driver's like, have you eaten? Be honest. Yes, to smell your breath before you get off. I was going to say that. <laughs> now, where the hell were you half the night? Out she catches him. They, he, he, they, the bus driver is the killer because she goes. Me, <sighs> he plays yeah. a little musical oh, note on his body because he has little holes oh. all over. <laughs> Ew! <laughs> He's like a human flute. flute. Yeah. 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 <laughs> People with trypophobia do not watch this episode. Yeah. Yeah. Trust me. Um, there was a subtitle that where the dad was like, uh, where were you last night? And he goes, he said something, but the subtitle said, you were with that Joey Bear, weren't you? <laughs> yes, Dad, I was preventing forest fires. <laughs> Dad, he's not a bear, he's a kangaroo, that's why he's called a Joey. <laughs> Come on. As a matter of fact, he had a beaver with him. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, remember taking the Can bus to school? Ew. No. Oh. Oh, that's right. We blocked that out of your We eternal sunshine of the solid's mind and you. But only for school buses. Nothing much, most of we talk. I bet. Nothing much, I monster. Do it <laughs> she has the worst nicknames for her friends. <clears throat> oh no, you guys froze. I'm the I'm the only one left now. So I'm taking this podcast over. Are you going to make jokes to myself now? Are you going to see Joey's fight? I want you to make out. No way. Oh, jeez. Oh, you're gross. Looks like we got a one-man show right now. I hope everybody's enjoying this. And... you almost done there? Yes, I'm almost finished. God damn it. Yeah, almost, Skipper. Okay, I'll be right back. Miller's time, you know. Hey, it's Miller's time, huh? Right, there was Skipper. Oh! I the guy's supposed to be Irish and Italian. Hi. Hi, welcome back. I've been holding I've been making jokes to myself for the last minute. Yeah. <laughs> yeah! I was saying that I was right, it is Skipper. Oh. I was talking and then I realized that both of you guys were frozen and I was like, oh no, not this again. Yeah. <laughs> Um, you missed you missed the, the the boat captain who was supposed to be like Irish, but he sounded Italian. Oh my god! <laughs> of course. It's weird for me. You guys froze, but I could keep yeah. watching the video. Me too. Oh, weird. Yeah, the movie was going, and then I just exited out and came back in because I was like, when you came back, Jax, everything unfroze for me. I didn't even touch it. Oh, weird. Yeah. So all the power's in my sure. hands. Sure. <laughs> in my Pretty grubby much. mitts. <laughs> Your old man's been on you again, huh? Ew. Gross. Gross. <laughs> Whoa. Forget about it. Listen, I get this so job that's in Portland. Do, we can kiss <laughs> do you have a kiss for daddy? No, Joey. I mean, when he said when he said somebody needs to pay the pot to play the pipe. Night. He meant something else. <laughs> oh, <laughs> boy. It's so weird. It's so crazy like. His Craigslist ad was looking for a fiddler. <laughs> oh, <laughs> could play oh his boy. <laughs> hey, Joey. You ready? Hey, pasta yeah, fuzzle. This guy's a salty sea dog. Yeah. Come on, darling. Oh. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Last week. See you later, Joey. Bye. Last, Last week, tea lady. lady. <laughs> <laughs> That's John Oliver's like rival show. Last week with Tea Lady Joe. <laughs> tea lady Joe. <laughs> that should be the shirt. It should look like it should look like last week tonight. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> tea Lady Joe sounds like a Miss Cleo type character. Yeah, yeah, but like, like an old, like an old British woman. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. 
How many of our shirts are just misheard or like? Oh, everyone, one hundred percent. Look out! It's a ghost car. How is that car just squealing down the road? Oh, jeez. She waited so long. It was a ghost car. I knew it. So, okay, so wait a second. So then now this movie is setting up that she has <laughs> visions, but there's just yes. a very real pipe killer who is, like, mm-hmm. totally unrelated to this. Pipe yes. killer? <laughs> Flute killer. What? He steals the copper pipes out of houses, like... <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> If he sees young kids smoking weed out of pipes, he just knocks the pipe out of their hands. <laughs> He's just like a ghost that snuffs it out. <laughs> and yeah. it keeps relighting it and it keeps going out. He goes, yeah. <sighs> He's the ghost of like a dare officer. <laughs> it's McGruff. <laughs> yeah. Oh no, it's the ghost of resource officer McClanahan. <laughs> <laughs> He died in the line of duty, and now he's back to take his vengeance on all of us. Whoa! I love these transitions. Do you love them? I do. Define. I genuinely do. I'm trying to think of a a line from Terminator where you can insert pipe (laughs) into it. Oh, God. You mean flute? (laughs) Or flute, yeah. I just think pan. I just think it's a pipe, you know. But it's you're yeah. right. It's a flute. Hmm. Nobody plays the pipe. <laughs> That's not an instrument. The pipe. The pipe piper. Does. Yeah. <laughs> Technically. He played a pipe that looked like an apple pie. <laughs> <laughs> no, he got pied while he was yeah, playing yeah. the pipe. Hey. Yeah. Where you headed? He got banana creamed. <laughs> oh no! Maybe, right maybe it's a mis- Maybe it's a. Uh, it was misheard. He was a pie piper. He would like pipe cream or something. Or like oh yeah, like pies. with a piping bag. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. He's like, check out nozzle number forty nine. <laughs> He's like, I've been trying to tell people for hundreds of years, and finally, Dan got it right. <laughs> We here on Never Heard of It are here to set the record straight. Mm-hmm. How about coming down help your mother set the table? What? Whoa. Whoa. Uh, Meanwhile, uh, in a different uh, movie. <laughs> <laughs> and then all of a sudden, Commander USA is like, how about those zombies? And we're like, what the fuck? He's just trying to save that job for his nice, pretty nephew, that's all. Oh. Marion is not going out with us. You should never tonight, is she? Refer to your oh, nephew as pretty. I know. Joey's a good kid. Yeah, he's a terrific kid. I mean, he's Come turned on. out you. just like his old man. He tries to get under every skirt in town. He's terrific. Mr. Rooney. Ed. <laughs> You're a beautiful man. For more than two years. Baharat. Baharat has been dead. <laughs> is that the god they pray to? Yeah. <laughs> he tried to put the make on. I I oh, no. <laughs> nobody puts nobody puts the make on baby. <laughs> she fell and hurt her knee. I'm gonna take her to the doctor tomorrow. Oh yeah, sure. After all, we can't have her banged up if she's gonna go out and visit her boyfriend now, can we? Okay, this is like you're not planning on sneaking out tonight. Why would you try to relate to your daughter by just shitting on her boyfriend all the time? Yeah, what? Jesus well, he doesn't Christ. want to. Here we go to again. That's all I hear now. You two don't know when yeah. to let up. Do you think I did it on purpose? Well, it was your fault, wasn't it? I mean, if oh, her leg. So drunk and run into that car, I wouldn't be a cripple now, would I? Don't you ever talk to me? Oh, wow, shit. they they bleeped out cripple. No, no I know. Good. You Thanks, you two. That's you nice of you. You yeah. are your little punk boyfriend. But also, I that's like I love. When movies do, well, no, I hate it, but it, I love when movies do that little bit of exposition where they're like, well, it wouldn't have been your fault that my legs messed up because you crashed the car in that one time two years ago and now I have to tell the audience about it. Like, okay. Show us. Don't tell us. Yes. It'll be like a scene with like two best friends and they're like, 
be, have been best friends their whole lives, and then they're like, I got a call from Jenny the other day. You know, my ex that I used to live with. And you're like, they would know that already. You don't have to tell me that. If, if that was in yeah. real life, you'd be like, who are you talking to? <laughs> I know this. No. I was there. I'm that person. Yeah. I, I, <laughs> what pun was that? <laughs> Oh, she's in the, at the docks. I was like, where the hell is this? She's in a disco. <laughs> That's why the lights are like that. Yeah. What is happening? She took the midnight boat going <laughs> anywhere. It's a moment of introspection, Dan. Let it happen. Oh, okay. This is where she we get to really thinking. know the character. Yes. If Mark did... were watching this movie, this is the scene that he would fast forward through to yeah. get to the action. <laughs> How are there so many rocks on that dock? Sweep up the dock. It's like... a rock. It's a rock dock. <laughs> it was a rock dock. Dock. <laughs> I was just gonna make a rock lobster joke. <laughs> she's there throwing rocks, rock and then she's like, <laughs> "Yeah, there yeah, goes a narwhal." Like, they should have just showed us this. We would infer by this yes. that she was in an accident. And, yes. like, the car. All you have to do is show the car hitting another car. In any yeah. Case, and this. We have that donor's name oh, there goes Dan. We do, doctor. The donor's there he is. And we're back. back. Oh! You heard that? Yeah, so she she had, she got she has the do, a donor. Ricky, Frankie Avalon's blood in her. Yeah. <gasps> oh. Yes. What's what was Frankie Avalon's big song? Um, I don't know, but I always think of that song, "Teenage Icon" by the Vaccines, where they talk about him. Mm. <laughs> I think of that before I think of an actual Frankie Avalon song. Let's see. If, if one of his songs was not Blood Song. Oh, that's true. <laughs> he looked like he just seen a ghost. Frankie Avalon's most Kinda. famous songs are "Venus," "Why," Kinda. "Bobby Socks to Stockings." <laughs> Okay. See you Gingerbread. Hey, oh, uh, look up, look up the the the, the skipper. Uh, uh, see if that's the guy who played Luca Brasi in. I think and, it is because <laughs> I saw him on the IMDb and I was like, wait, that guy's familiar. Yeah, <laughs> if that's him, oh my god. <laughs> Everybody has bad dreams. Yeah, it is him. Wow. Why does this keep happening to us? <laughs> Why is he in every movie we watch? Well, it's too. Hell. But and, and, and I hope that your child is a disabled child on the day of your daughter's accident. Of your daughter's accident. Today, on my way home, I saw this van. I wonder how many other things we're going to get to see him in. When I look back up, there was nothing. It vanished. Oh, he wasn't in that much other there. stuff. I was like, just nerves or am I losing my mind? He's like, okay, so the, the guy who played um, Fredo, uh, who's in uh, Dog Day Afternoon, John Cazale, he's like very yeah. famous for being only in five movies, but every single one was nominated for an Academy Award. The guy yes. who played Luca Brasi is like the opposite. Every movie that he was in. <laughs> it's going to be on this show at some point. Yeah, it's going to literally be yeah. on this show. <laughs> I forgot, I forgot what other movie he was in, but it's Evil Speak. Yeah, it is. Yeah, he plays the cook. Uh, yes. I could picture him as the cook, but I, I was trying to think of, like, what movie did we watch where they were, like, at camp or something? Mm. But I knew the only camp one we've watched is the one with Joey Pants, but we didn't actually watch it. So. Right. He, he had that famous line in Evil Speak where he was like... <laughs> I remember that. That's crazy. Yeah. Yeah. And then he saw the devil and he was like... Oh. <laughs> you need to get a line that like something that he said so that we can use it if we ever see him again oh yeah <laughs> on this the day of your daughter's wedding and I hope that your first uh, uh. child is a masculine child He's really obsessed with the masculinity of their first child. <laughs> oh, boy. I was going to say something else about Frankie Avalon, but now I don't remember. Did 
today we're going to watch yeah. Psycho. <laughs> Here it comes. <gasps> yes. Yes. Meanwhile, in a printer that needs ink. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Um, the, what I was going to say was that he also sings Beauty School Dropout. Oh, that's the one. I told you yeah, my dad. Which made was probably like inspired his renaissance, which is why he's in this. Didn't have enough time to teach me anything else. <laughs> he just said the driver just said you've been playing that song for over an hour. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> well, maybe you want to get yourself another teacher. Hot cross buns. <laughs> he's like, you want to hear the most annoying sa- a song in the world? <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna. <laughs> I was just gonna say it's like dumb and dumb. <laughs> <laughs> If this van's a flutin', don't bother scootin'. <laughs> I'd just like to say I'm glad we picked a movie that so far kind of has a plot as compared to last week, which was yeah. like pulling teeth. <laughs> what was he like commenting on his own piss? <laughs> oh, nice. Nice. Nice, nice stream. Good yeah. flush. <laughs> <laughs> oh, a masculine no. flow <laughs> and I hope you're flow <laughs> oh. oh applause what, what did he hit him with <laughs> an axe oh, oh, oh. it's hard to see yeah okay but why why would he come to this girl just cause she has his blood how would he know that well there's they're they're, they're Psychically they're, connected. They're ah, yes. Well, Marion, looks like they're that basically last twins. Did the mm-hmm. Well, that yes. Right. That's like well, I'm sure there must be a anyway. movie where somebody it? gets like a heart transplant from a murderer mm-hmm. or something and becomes no, a murderer. No, yeah. That has to exist. Oh, I knew it was, but I just the Simpsons it. did a parody where Homer right. gets a hair transplant. Oh yeah. And then he turns into a, he turns into a snake, like the the criminal. Yeah. Thanks. I'm gonna, I feel like that's, that's definitely a thing where somebody gets. Remember, young let's lady, see. I want oh, yeah, it's organ. definitely a movie. Yeah. Oh, I Murder. Oh, there's also a movie, uh, a recent movie, where somebody gets an eye transplant. And then they see horrible things or something like that. Oh. I can't remember what that movie is called, though. Okay, okay, there's a 1991 movie called Body Parts. And it says, the film follows a psychologist who undergoes an experimental arm transplant and begins having visions of murders. It's all in the arm. What? <laughs> that's, the that's memory is stored your, in the arm. <laughs> that's, that's where your vision goes. Yeah. It's, yeah. it's all processed in the arm. I, I'm seeing all these weird yeah. things. Uh, yeah, that's all in your arm. Very strong. Yeah. Very black. Coffee, Betty. Your, Whoa, your coffee, Betty. Cortex, I am a lamp. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of coffee you want? Black Betty. <laughs> Black Betty had a cup. Bam, a lamp. <laughs> but it wasn't dark enough. Bam, a lamp. <laughs> There's a 2009 movie called Telltale, uh, where a guy gets a heart transplant, and then he has to avenge the guy's murder, because I guess the guy whose heart it was. Uh, like the telltale heart. And, yeah, and the first review on IMDb says better than you think. Well, I tell you what, wait till four o'clock and then train them loose. Ah, thanks, Betty. Love it. Anything else? I knew I had to yeah, exist. Uh, look up the movie about the eye transplant. Oh. It, it, it was. It, I think it's recent, within like the last 15, 15, 10, 15 years. Or something. Out about jurisdiction, right? Okay. Now out, out. The two of you out. I want two hours of peace and quiet. Yeah, so it's the eye with, with Jessica Alba. That's it, yep. Three bricks on yep. Main she was blind, and then she gets a double corneal transplant, and then she starts having frightening visions. I like how of maybe, a maybe terrifying she's just, alternate world. 
Maybe she's just seeing the real world, but she's terrified of it because she's been born. She doesn't understand it. Honestly, I'd be afraid of a lot of the shit I see, too. <laughs> yeah, right? We're just used to it. A I dog know. barks and she's like, that's what they look like? That's him? <laughs> <laughs> that's him? Well, I guess I can get in there. <laughs> oh, boy, I thought I'd never get a ride. This movie has everything. Family, Mark murder, Mans, trauma, mental hospitals, Great, um, yeah. a differently Probably abled person as a victim, uh, a dad who hates his teenage daughter, <laughs> Frankie Avalon. Superb. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean anything. Sorry, it's don't touch my My daddy made this for me, and it's really very delicate. I think we understand that this guy's the killer. We don't need a flashback to that. <laughs> we're not that stupid. Just because we're watching this movie doesn't mean we're dumb. <laughs> Hey, oh, what does this guy's shirt say? Uh, yes. Uh, it's tomorrow night, isn't it? Yeah. They're going to Mark no, Camel's yeah, party. <laughs> They're going to Mark's <laughs> Camel party. Yeah. Good luck with the big you know that famous actor from Star Wars, Mark <laughs> Campbell? <laughs> <laughs> it's a real Don Myrera situation. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sad we didn't get to see that guy's shirt. Yeah. He'll come back. He's going to die. They wouldn't introduce him if I he was wasn't going to die. Give me a five bucks worth. Sure. Listen, uh, tell me where the closest motel is. Sure, it's right up the road. About a mile. Oh, sorry. Did I say motel? I meant mortuary. <laughs> Mayor, I'm so glad you are dumping that stupid brace. Boy, Kathy, the way you sound, you think you were wearing it. Practically, I'm gonna follow you around. I'm gonna carry you. I mean, I think I uh, if I had to choose between a cane and a brace, I might choose the brace. Because the cane is a very specific look. If you can't smack somebody, I think she might brace. have both. <laughs> well, the, uh, to be the cane, like it, you have to be real cool to pull the cane off if you're young. And the cane has to also be a sword. That's true. <laughs> a, a cigarette so, lighter on one side and a, <laughs> and yeah. a sword on the other. And also a gun. That's true. Yes. This is a real, like, League of Extraordinary Gentlemen type weapon. <laughs> I know. <laughs> R.I.P. Sean Connery. Oh, I know. Friend of the show. Fan of the show. Rip. Yeah. Big fan. Friend he was our first show. subscriber. Uh, his final words were, did, did I get yeah, my shirt from Never Heard of It? Go to the party with <laughs> <laughs> Bury me in my I Hate Sam shirt. Yeah. Yeah. I really hate <laughs> Sam. <laughs> Bastard. I wish you'd try. You gonna be able to see me out tomorrow? Oh, I'll get this somehow. Ugh. Ooh. Oh, I should oh, get this. That sounds so loud. I should get yeah, this. We don't need ASMR kissing. <laughs> I know. It's the last thing we need. <laughs> um, I should get the sound effects. It's like the 80s audience going, ooh. Yes. And just insert it right there. Yeah. This is worse to watch than any of the sex scenes we've had to watch. <laughs> I'd rather watch Rock and Roll Nightmare, the shower scene, than listen to them kiss in high definition Bye. audio. Bye. Can you dub that scene with the audio from Toast of London? Where they do the <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> oh, uh. yeah. <laughs> the only acceptable loud kissing noises. Yeah. <laughs> Nay. <laughs> I need to rewatch that. Damn, so early. Uh, that's a that's a big never heard of it recommendation. Mm -hmm. Toast yeah. of London. Christ. Teenagers in their goddamn trash cans. <laughs> Teenagers are just like raccoons. <laughs> <laughs> Always digging in my trash. <laughs> Always eating with their very small hands. <laughs> <laughs> How cute. <laughs> Oh, she threw it out. 
I told you, no more wire braces. <laughs> <laughs> I said no, Kane. I told you you're not cool enough. Oh, how could I have ever doubted that she would sneak out at night? <gasps> Why, where is she supposed to keep that? Oh, okay. I, I would see. wake up instantly. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> what? I mean, I know she's faking it, but like, what? Yeah, I would, that wake, would wake up. Me up. Yep. Yeah. Yes. I'm a I'm a deep sleeper, but that would wake me up. Yeah, don't you fucking yeah. touch me. <laughs> Seriously. And like if I woken up in the middle of the night by like something touched me, I, I immediately verbalize like yeah. my like frustration or whatever. Yeah. I'm always like, huh, what what? <laughs> <laughs> Just in case it's someone like coming to rob me or something, <laughs> so they think they, they yeah. freak I know. out. Oh, He's alive! <laughs> Joey wakes up and just immediately starts screaming. <laughs> I need an adult. I need an adult. <laughs> That's going to be great for when the baby comes and she starts crying and Joey goes, what, what, what? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'll already be up and the bags on my eyes will be down to here. <laughs> I know. <laughs> The jokes are going to start making a lot more sense in, uh, around December 7th. Mm -hmm. <laughs> She's got to eat. Transition. She's got to eat every two to three hours, so. I know. Here we go. Here we go. Joe's going to be like, do you guys want to record an episode on Tuesday at 3 a.m.? <laughs> <laughs> I'll be awake anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Our new episode premieres Thursday morning at 6.15 a.m. <laughs> Joey's just gonna get up. He's gonna be in the middle of the night recording, like, as if he's each of us. Yeah. I know. He's gonna watch the movie and make his own jokes and then watch it again with, like, a different clothes on and be like, I'm dead. Yeah. <laughs> he's gonna ask us to, like, move out of the way so he can take a picture of our backgrounds and then do it, like, in Zoom where that's his background. Yeah, exactly. Why? <laughs> I, just need, I just need to make a, a jack spot <laughs> yeah. I know or it's gonna be like like uh, all the episodes are gonna have like crazy edits all over them like there's like flames and like sound effects and stuff oh I'm gonna have to blur this out why couldn't her nipple just be realize. like right out of frame I know one more inch and we would have been fine close your eyes and I'll give you a big surprise <laughs> Is it the flute? He starts playing. For me? Uh-huh. Yeah. He's like, no, I just wanted to show you how good it looks on me. Yeah. <laughs> I admired you on the gunshot Nuria. Was that, was that like an old boat? I was going to say, the way you said it made it sound like the battleship Nuria. <laughs> oh, off the port bow, it's the gunshot Noria. <laughs> Right, no, Starbuck. It's beautiful. <laughs> no, don't fire. We can't fire just yet. It's too beautiful. Oh, no, nothing more romantic. <laughs> That's what I was gonna say. Than that. Spend one or two nights there. Hope you like hot cross buns. Well, I don't think I can really. Sorry, I can't hear you. What? Does he just? Yeah, he just plays on the talks. the first Every time she starts talking, it gets louder. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Is that the only song he knows how to play? Just stop playing that yeah. damn thing for two minutes and just listen to me. I mean, I know we just met, but we're in a relationship now. Yeah. I take things too quickly. <laughs> Look, I like you. You're a nice guy. But I just can't. Don't you like my music? <laughs> no. Nothing personal. Of course not. But not as much as you do. Oh, she's about to get her head cut off with an axe. How's this? That's pretty. Well, I mean, that's real pretty. Uh, that would break. I'm sorry. Yep.
This guy's like is such it, a little is man. Music just a bunch He's of got it's like four feet tall. <laughs> I know. <laughs> His proportions are all wrong. My shoulders slope down. I have small hands. I'm a little guy. <laughs> to kill me too i know it i know it <laughs> the guy whose blood i have he's gonna kill me sure if you wait right here i'll be right back thank you very much but only thanks for that voiceover right <laughs> don't if you don't wait here i won't come back <laughs> he goes in the next room and he's like i'm not coming back <laughs> the name is cons i have a small farm just outside cons cons the name is cons james cons is that you now they called her friend said she left the day before yesterday. Was she driving? No. Hitchhiking. Yeah. Hey, trekking. Hey, trekking. Oh, yeah, know. I'm trekking up to, to, to Portland. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm going to be riding the old trike. <laughs> <laughs> With, like, the it's... knees up high like this. <laughs> <laughs> It's Jigsaw, right? Yeah. <laughs> Speaking. I gotta go. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm trying to get up to Portland. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you Are you trying up to Boston? <laughs> Do you want to ride a truck? <laughs> no? Oh, sorry. Sorry. <laughs> It'd be weird if the dock was actually floating away and not the boat. She's like, wait, where am I going? <laughs> How sad is that? Like, We're anchored. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> I, I get the premise of, like I was saying with all the other movies where it's like she has his blood so she, she sees what he's doing but why would he know where she is that's right I don't I don't I listen have oh you ever gosh. had magical murderer blood inside of you because if not no but I have given blood and I don't feel any connection to any of the people who <laughs> might have my blood so. <laughs> you don't know that maybe you're naturally drawn to people who have your blood mm. that's a good point I'm I'm O negative, so anybody could have it. Oh, Next negative. Song. <laughs> oh. Like the band, type O negative. Bruh. That band's based on me. <laughs> you guys like this song? Mm -hmm. It's my favorite song. New birds on the beach, eating scraps of food. <laughs> Let's see if Blood Song has like an original, an OST. And, and wait, and wait, why isn't Frankie Avalon the one who sings the original song? Right? <laughs> Frankie, we don't want you for your voice. We want you for your physical screen presence. No, he costs too much to also have a voice. <laughs> yeah. You can't afford, you can't afford a glass of orange juice and a pack of smokes. Nobody can, <laughs> damn it. <laughs> Okay, the um, tagline for this movie is when he whistles this tune, the time for killing begins. That's the worst tagline. I thought it was gonna rhyme. I know. Yeah. When he whistles this tune, your death is soon. <laughs> there you go. I wonder if this song is just called um, Blood Song. Um, on the Wikipedia it says, Film scholar Scott Aaron Stein wrote, As derivative as this script may be, Blood Song is surprisingly palatable. <laughs> I mean, Where's so the compliment? Far, I agree. Yeah. I don't mind the taste. <laughs> yeah. That 
That's like the the worst backhanded compliment. Imagine being a film scholar and you're writing about blood song. <laughs> Imagine just being a film scholar. I know. <laughs> I mean, that's what we're doing. I, that's true. We are we're video nasty scholars. Mm -hmm. I think if we have the pick. <gasps> Leaves. <laughs> Wigs. <laughs> Blood. I can sense it. I can smell it. It's my right as American citizen to carry a weapon. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I hope the handle of the axe is also a flute. <laughs> <laughs> Good thing Oregon has stand your ground laws. Oh, does he like oh, throw the axe and it goes? He throws the axe and goes like. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Hot cross buns, hot cross buns, hot cross buns. <laughs> <laughs> Married a little way. <laughs> <laughs> There's gotta be one other song, right, that you learn <laughs> on recorder? Uh, took a took a little song. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. For some reason, I was gonna say Frere oh, Jacques. We are the world, we are the that? children. What just happened to Dan? Oh, I don't know. Was that a fire alarm? Yeah. Uh oh. Imagine we just see smoke now in his screen. <laughs> he comes back, his hair's all charred. <laughs> yeah, he's like, it's okay, guys. We got it just in time. <laughs> it's only second degree burns. Yeah. <laughs> oh no. Jesus, man. What's wrong? Who How the fuck is that? What happened? Sorry, it was <laughs> weird. Norman. <laughs> you just, she ran to an albino camp. <laughs> he's a black man and he's he parked like, by the picnic tables. He looks like, um... Sure. Jeffrey Dahmer and He-Man. Yeah. Thanks, I have the flute. <laughs> right, because isn't okay, He-Man's hair like that? Yeah. Kind of yeah. Yeah, hold on more. It's a real mop top. Mm-hmm. Kind of with with some nice Nothing bangs. Maybe just thought you saw something. And we shot at those, so I know that they're <laughs> not going to attack us. Can you just take me home now? Also, like, sure. this is just, like, speaks to the way that men write about women. It's like she sees mm -hmm. something horrible, and then the guy's like, well, maybe you just imagined it. Well, you don't just imagine horrible things happening. No. This girl who has no history of hallucinations or anything. I saw a guy with a head in a bag, and he tried to attack me with an axe. You were just, it's all in your arm. I mean, get, you'll get yeah, over it. It's all, yeah. Uh, maybe, uh, maybe it's that time of the month for you. Yeah, I yeah, don't know. Yeah. You know? <laughs> maybe you need to go lie down. <laughs> Why don't you take a my doll and chill? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, guys, come on. Please. It's really like you really expose yourself when you write like that. Yeah. <laughs> like exactly. you expose your own feelings. Especially if there's no broader narrative point to that. Sh yeah. If, if you're not like specifically highlighting that, like shave them off. <laughs> what? The guy said, see you tomorrow, and the subtitle says, shave them off. <laughs> shave them off. <laughs> shave them off. Oh, uh, when we say, yeah, when we say bye later, we'll say, shave them off. <laughs> shave them off. It's our new sign-off. Um, but yeah, it's not like... Uh, what, Dan, is your apartment on fire? Yeah, the whole thing's burning down. <laughs> no, our, oh, okay, good, our good. smoke alarms are like super sensitive. Like... Uh, when Paige, I mean, we're, we're, she's cooking dinner, but um, like she'll be making like a grilled cheese, and we have to like turn the vent fan on and open the the door oh, to the balcony, Jesus. otherwise the, the smoke alarm goes off. Oh and my they're God. like all hooked up, so we have like we have like two in the living room, like one in like the kitchen area, one in the living room, one in my bedroom, one in her bedroom. And wow. when one of them goes off, they all start beeping. Like they're oh, all connected, Jesus. so it's just like the whole. And then you have to uh, you have to get on a wobbly stool to push the button. And, like, of course. Yeah, it's so stupid. Our fire alarm is one that talks, so when it goes off, it goes oh, fire, 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 <laughs> oh, fire. <Jesus. laughs> 
Uh, all you missed in was that after she saw the murderer, she ran and found a bunch of guys that she knew, and they basically told her she was imagining it, and then they took her home. Yeah. Oh. They're like, you're hysterical. Yeah. Exactly. Then we talked about how, how terribly men write women characters. Yes. I think they love it. I haven't seen much of the place yet, but I'm really concerned Like, it's not, it's not like part of the plot is that, like, Nobody's ever believed her because she's always said crazy things like this. So there's yeah. like a point right, to like, them saying that. Like they think she caused the accident, but she didn't. Right. So like, yeah. therefore, like they now like have mischaracterized. Right. Her. But no, she's just a normal person. But she sees a guy who chases her with an axe, and all of a sudden she's crazy. Yeah. yeah right. Thank you. And all of a sudden I'm crazy. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Oh, and then one of the guys said, what did he say? Uh, See you later or something? But the subtitle said, shave them off. <laughs> <laughs> so now, so at the end of the episode, instead of saying bye, we just have to say, shave them off. Shave, shave them off. Shave them off. That's what they say when like a, a Navy ship is leaving the port. Shave them off. Yeah, shave them off. Nice <laughs> band. Yeah, thanks. Or when someone's like, should I keep my sideburns? <laughs> I couldn't think of a, of a type of hair that you would refer to as them. Mm, dread, dreadlocks? Dread, yeah, I was going to say Oh, that that's true. That's true. I think that's a good idea, sure. If I got a lot of crap in this film, you know, I think a lot of things will just... Sounds like home. Don't worry about it. Oh, my God, it's full of shit. <laughs> oh, no. What? Oh, somebody! See you later. Somebody contacted him on the oh. radio. Okay, as a police okay? officer, what convenient timing? Whatever you think of police officers, if if you're a police officer who's doing their job and you're investigating a van that you think might be suspicious, you wouldn't stop looking at the van to answer the radio. You would yeah. you would inspect no! the van and see if there's anything suspicious yes! and then go answer the radio. The radio can wait. Yes. Yeah. Oh, look, see, this guy was just ordering a fucking sandwich. Ah, uh, the mighty Puma. <laughs> oh, my God, this is the darkest classroom. Now we're going to take a quiz. It turns, off, it turns off all the lights. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody, get under your blankets. We're going to do a quiz. <laughs> it forces you to focus more. I hate when they do that with the cops in the movies, vision. where they t they turn the handle and they open the door. It's like, where well, we got a seven five two three at uh, Johnson Street. And it's like, hey, I'll, I'll just take this and one of the same. Sorry, creepy yeah. guy who I suspected of being a murderer. I don't think you're. A murderer and now you now. can just drive away. Okay, bye. Oh wait, was, was she a great big fat person? Oh no, you're not the killer. <laughs> 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 After I do some stuff for my mom, let's go over to the pizza house, okay? Let's talk about mom. Pizza house. house. <laughs> I want to go there. It's, okay, it's, it's the shirt is a Pizza Hut logo. It says Pizza House. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> yeah. Uh -huh. We did have two shirts yep. now. No, no, yep. it's nothing like that. I just got a lot on my mind. That's all. Pizza house. <laughs> nobody, nobody. I out. live there. Nobody out pizzas the house. <laughs> Are we really gonna run away together? Yeah, if this job in Portland works out. But you Nobody knows what's in my secret box. Back. Not even a pizza house. <laughs> <laughs> Did you hear something? Hear what? Oh, nothing. Never mind. It sounded like the pizza house jingle. <laughs> <laughs> Which is. <laughs> <laughs> hot crust pizzas. <laughs> it's hot crust pizzas. Yes. <laughs> yes. Perfect. Deep dish pizzas. Deep dish pizzas. <laughs> Sorry, my oh, boots are a little squeaky. Got squeaky boots. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> are we done? Play that air horn. Oh yeah, that's right. Sorry, I should always have this. I should have this on a. <clears throat> oh, he did it for me. That's it. <laughs> done. Done. <laughs> oh, thank you, Blood Song. You've been so good to 
was. Oh, Jesus. It also Ooh. would have been perfect if the fire, the smoke alarm started going up. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Every time I tell a joke, fire, fire. <laughs> <laughs> it's lit. <laughs> <laughs> and that joke was fire. <laughs> oh, jams in it. Oh, God. <laughs> Oh, God, I wish he had fallen when he said great trip. <laughs> oh, right into the water. Joey, I've not talked to you. This time it was no dream. <laughs> that man I told you I dreamt about, I saw him. I mean, I really saw him. He was bearing a body. I know it was a body. He was Where? bearing a body. Just above Beck's beach. Joey, <laughs> I know it was a body. <laughs> he started to chase me. don't believe me either. I... But I know what I saw yesterday. Did you call Would that shit? be either of your first reactions no, to say, I don't you. believe you? It's not like she said, I saw a ghost, I saw a monster, I saw a zombie. She said, I saw a guy and he chased me in the woods. I'd be like, holy shit. Yeah. Like, why would you not? But that's a very plausible situation. Yeah. Mayor, will you slow down? No, you don't believe me either. You're just like my folks. That's all, folks. What do you want me to do about it? Come to Beck's speech with me right now and I'll prove it to you. Right now. I don't want to go to Glen Beck's beach. I hate that place. <laughs> I do not want to go. Days. <laughs> no. If you want to help me, we'll go right now. I don't want to see Glen Beck in a speedo or whatever. <laughs> 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 oh, oh, <laughs> He's like having a good time. <laughs> <laughs> this girl's about to dig up this body. <coughs> Ma'am, please. It was here. It was right here. What is he digging with? His bear hands. Arr. It's like those uh, those bear claws that used to like shred pulled pork. Yeah. Yeah, I promise. So. Come on, please keep digging. Okay, but like, think about this logically. Oh, well, they're gonna find the body. I was gonna say, uh -huh. would he just like bury it somewhere else if he saw some? If somebody saw him burying a body? Yeah. That's true. Maybe he put it in the van, he back in the van. That's why the cop couldn't look inside. Yes. Yeah. Do you think he's gonna just find the flute? Mm. Nothing but garbage. Which is what you are. We're done. <laughs> I was gonna say, which is what you are, insert name here, but I don't know her name, so. I was here, I saw it. I think it's Mary or Marianne, I think. Or yeah. Mar is it Marge? I'm not saying you didn't see Marg. Mar oh, it's Marg's camel party? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> One hump or two. <laughs> That's up to you. I think it is Marianne, because it says Mary. Oh, uh, yeah. There was a fan here, there was a man here, and there was a body here, right there. There was, there was a, a fan, man. there was a man, there was a plan, <laughs> there was a can, <laughs> there was a pocket flam. Sheriff, it's just radioed in. I ran. <laughs> and then I met up with Stan, he and he put me tan. in the van. <laughs> Seven eight six five code six one oh seven. What's up? <laughs> I'm just making it up as we go along, <laughs> officer. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> In all my years. <laughs> Somebody poured fake blood on a real dog. <laughs> That's exactly what that looked like. <laughs> yeah. Joey, it was so real. I know, but try not to think about it. Remember, you promised. You promised not to think about it. Mm, that helps. I can't. That's impossible. <laughs> Clear your mind. Don't Clear think your about mind. That. Out of respect. 
Who choosed? Did you choose? Just popped in there. <laughs> Smooth Miller genuine draft. <laughs> he's got he's got Dromax in there. <laughs> no, it's you. Bex. Yeah, uh, yeah. Ah! And then he's smoking a camel. Mm -hmm. yeah, my father will come after us. He looks at the label also, and he's like, Oh, duels? <laughs> <laughs> I hate to be the party pooper, but I'm thinking. I was going to say, can neither I, of these people look like they're in high school. Get there? No. No. I wish I could take you with me now. <laughs> As a 40 year old man, I wish I could take you with me. <laughs> I've been held back 14 times. <laughs> Mama shall call. Mama shall call. <laughs> That's what she calls herself in third person. Yeah. <laughs> Mama shall call sounds like it's like a 60s like or 50s doo-wop song. Yeah. Yeah. Mama shall call. <laughs> This is a very musical episode. <laughs> he lives right there? <laughs> he just drives like two, two houses down. Let me take you home. <laughs> <laughs> Ew, that's so awkward. Maybe he just dropped her off two houses down from him. Uh, He's like, oh, I can't, I can't, uh, my parents... They can't see you uh, in the car with me. That's right. He, he doesn't yeah. take her home. She just has to walk. <laughs> she has to walk nine Why miles that... to her house. Yeah. <laughs> with her bum knee. Yeah. Why would, once again, why would that be a plot point that he lives right fucking there? Yeah. You don't have to show us where he lives. Yeah. Oh, you had a good time at night, didn't you? Ew. Yeah, I did. Wow. <gasps> Whoa! Whoa! Language! Language! What did I tell you? If I ever caught the two of you, you know what I- Brad, don't! Pa, oh, shut up and stay out of this. I will not stay out of this. There's no reason but I will for shut up. you to be doing what you're doing. You <laughs> <laughs> she just stands there in silence. I swear it. Yeah. I'm telling you, I saw you. Couldn't do anything. I saw you. Hey, we have that PTA meeting. Uh, right, you gotta I'm beat him, right? right? I saw you. <laughs> I'm staying right here in this house. Is that kid, he had a taste. He's going to be coming back tonight for more. What do you mean by that? I mean that I know kids. And if we leave this house... That oh, okay, here's what's going to happen. The killer's going to come into the house. The dad That's thinks it's the kid. Either. And then the killer Ooh. kills the dad. Uh-oh. You go to your room, you stay there. Because I am staying right here. Mom, and I'm going to stare right, right into your me, eyes all night so I know you don't go anywhere. <laughs> go on upstairs and I'll see you when I get back. I won't be late. I've never had a problem holding a man's gaze. <laughs> Do you remember from uh, uh, you Dark Place? Gone, you will be late. That's what Richard uh, Iwane yes. says. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. About being an actor. You're only a child. <laughs> Can't you see what you're doing? I was thinking about rewatching that the other day. It's so good. Because some, something somewhere, somebody, I don't know, somebody's like Twitter bio or something said Dreamweaver and I thought about that. <laughs> like, of dreams. Like clearly as a joke but I thought about author Dreamweaver. Blood. 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 <laughs> All over the post office floor or whatever he says. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and bits of sick. When he's like yeah. maggots, maggots and bits of sick. Yeah. One of my favorite things in that show is when Richard Ayoade hangs up the phone and then picks him back up to say yeah, goodbye. Yeah, this is hangs it up again. Yeah. <laughs> I, I I like uh, my one of my favorite Richard Ayoade moments is the when he's like I don't know he says something and then he's like or I'll give you a knuckle supper. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. that's right. And he's holding that's the shovel. One of my favorites. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's the best show ever. Can we watch that as like a special episode of, of this show? Yeah, yeah. Can we watch it? Just watch an episode of Dark Place? It's on YouTube, right? Yes, it is. Done. 
when you hit your dad and he's trying to get into your room and you don't <laughs> want him to get into your room. Wait, there's there's also that hit a, by the a, cure. A dark place. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, there's also an episode of Dark Place where there's like something to do with mist, and at the end he's like standing on the roof of the hospital, and he's like, "I guess you could say we've reached some sort of mist understanding." <laughs> <laughs> That's the best. That's the best fucking show. This Renwick custom. <laughs> nah. What happened between you and this Renwick customer? In the very first episode when that woman shakes the guy's hand. Or he shakes, she shakes Matt yeah. Berry's hand and he's like, Yeah! Ah! yeah. <laughs> I, is it the first episode where the guy explodes? Yes. And it's just like yeah. his head on the ground? Okay. <laughs> That's Renwick. Yeah, I thought so. Oh my god. Garth Marenghi's Dark Place. Uh. That, that's a never heard of it wreck. Yes. yes. A true wreck. Please. I'll grab some clips for the next episode. Some sound yes. clips. That would be great. Literally anything that Richard Ayoade says in that show is perfect. The delivery. Mm-hmm. Just getting in a little bit of froth before bed, Mom. A little bit of what? Froth. Frisbee golf. Oh, 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 yeah. Okay, sorry, I should have known. <laughs> he looks so happy. I love frisbees. Come on, let's go come on now. Wow, let's, let's go, go come, come on, on now. now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Do you know that? A song? <laughs> yes. Do you know that our our videos have subtitles? Yes. Like this mm-hmm. will have... Because I, I was watching our last one for some reason. And it had subtitles. Yeah, and I was like, wow, we can make fun reason. of our own subtitles. Yeah. Well, why would I... I'm in it. Why would I watch it? <laughs> I <know. laughs> I'm in it. It's like... It, it's like I wouldn't be a part of a club that would have me as a member. I wouldn't watch a show I'm, I'm the main character in. Because mm-hmm. <laughs> this is a character. This isn't the real me. No, no. This is like close. this is like Andrew Dice Clay. This is like uh, <laughs> we got a real Larry, Daniel Day Lewis over here. here. Yeah, yeah. This well, is a, I, I make everybody call me Mr. Lincoln. <laughs> <laughs> oh, get him! Oh, that was an antique. All of the, you know. All the lamps in my house are really light. I feel like if I hit someone with it, they'd be fine. Yeah. I guess lamps just used to be heavier. You fight like Frankie Avalon. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't believe you till it was too late. Your dad. <laughs> <laughs> I know. So is is he feeling how the girl feels in addition to her feeling how he feels? I guess. I'm how would that Time to get work? Work? <laughs> His blood is I sending don't know. memories back to him from her body. Yes. Ah, yes. The blood transfer goes both ways. Yes. We have to get it's this just like again. in Young Frankenstein. <laughs> Yeah. Win 1,000. Groceries? Well, hell yeah. I'm in. How does this place stay in business? I guess they're not. It's closed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Under new management. Shelves are empty. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They're like, oh, I really didn't think that promotion was going to be that popular. <laughs> One day only. Free groceries. Oh, oh, one day only, free of Dan. Mm-hmm. There he is. I 
had to go get some free groceries. Uh. <laughs> okay, good. <laughs> <Sorry>. <laughs> It's always nice when I'm not the only one who has technical difficulties. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, this happens to me in every episode, at least two or three times. I know, it's so I weird. Just, like, disappear for a second. Well, but, it's just like Discord yeah. freezes and it like it reloads and then I'm back in immediately. Yeah. People should buy our shirts so that we can get you a dedicated streaming computer. Yes. There you go. I would yeah, use so my desktop if it wasn't out in the middle of the living room. I know. Literally we could just get you like a... center of the living room. It's between the couch and the TV. <laughs> yeah. It's yeah. really awkward. <laughs> and all the wires are like everywhere. I know. <laughs> yeah. We're gonna, we're gonna get you, Dan, like a little uh, collapsible, like soundproof yeah, little screen booth. to put around you. Yeah. Finally, the, uh, the mill. Mm-hmm. Right? Wasn't that the, the in the synopsis? Like a killer so. hunts a woman at a, a sawmill? Let's see. Oh, what? Oh, apparently Blood Song is also a book. Oh, oh that's what he said based on the story by... Oh, that's yeah. right. Uh, it's it's she's cornered in a lumber yard. Oh, lumber yard. No, no, there's a different blood song. <gasps> the sixth order wields the sword of justice and smites the enemies of the faith and the realm. Valen Al Sorna was only a child of ten when his father left him at the iron gate of the sixth order. <laughs> etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. Are, are you reading sentences? Are, they, <laughs> what, what, are you just <laughs> saying words? <laughs> <laughs> no, the- <laughs> that was actually the first chapter of the book. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's by Anthony Ryan. A masterwork you don't want to miss. <gasps> Elton. It is with temerity that I declare Blood Song as one of the best debut novels I've ever read. What? Wow. I'm sorry, Anthony Ryan. I didn't mean to make fun of you. Jesus. <laughs> wait, wait, did Frankie Avalon write that, write that review? <laughs> Yes. yes. <laughs> no, film scholar Austin Scott, whatever from earlier. Austin Scott Card. Yeah. <laughs> yes. It's his brother. Yeah. It's Orson's brother. Very nice, Marion. <laughs> Do you think Orson Scott Card was named after Orson Welles? And then he's like, well, fuck, I have to write sci fi. Mm. God damn it. I have no choice. Yeah, but did he have to be a homophobe? <laughs> yes. Mm, that was a choice. <laughs> oh, it, okay, so... At the end of the movie, he, he's going to be, like, teetering on the edge, and he's about to, like, fall onto the machinery, and then he's she's going to say, well, guess who's the beauty school dropout now? And then lets him <laughs> fall. <laughs> <laughs> and then he's like, I don't get it! As he's falling. Is she going to, she's going to, like, whistle a tune to, like, catch him off guard, yeah. right? Yeah. Like, it echoes Do you think- in the, in the yeah. room or whatever. Yeah. Do you think if he dies, she feels it, though? Yeah, they're going to do that thing where they do a close-up on her eyes, and it yeah. swirls. Uh, but then he's going to be dead. And then dead. it goes straight to the credits. Wait, no, she's going to, like, smash his little flute thing or something. Uh, oh, no. That would be a real jerk move. Also, like, they should have said that. dad made that for him. Did, did the dad work at the lumberyard? I think this is just a coincidence. Because they shouldn't have the dad be a... He works at the lumber yard, so she knows that she can go there. And his office, yeah, she knows that he has, like, a gun in his office or something. Or whatever, you know, yeah. like... Yeah. No, I think it's just they wanted a, a location for the dramatic showdown at the end. I don't think there's a real reason. So mad. 
mad. I mean, you would be too. I know, but he doesn't even look like it hurts. It just looks like he's angry. Really hard. <laughs> I didn't want to call attention to him. Oh, Frankie Evelyn, how hard did she hit you? Really hard. Really hard. <laughs> All right, take two. Not so hard this time. She actually stabbed him in real life. Yeah. <laughs> One of those famous scenes where people actually get hurt. Mm -hmm. Marion! Marion? Or Marianne? I think Marion. Maid Marion. Yeah. Yes. Marion Barry. Yeah, I was gonna say that too. It's Matt Barry's sister. <laughs> You know this for, If we watched this on Kinda Heard of It We would have predicted this ending 100% Well it's in the description <laughs> yeah, I know right. <laughs> Yeah So what do you even need the rest of the movie for This yeah. is like Nothing else is happening Week after week I just think about The money that was spent on And time and effort mm -hmm. spent on these movies That could have been spent on something good Yes you could have given this money yeah. to somebody who wanted to make a real thing, mm -hmm. but no. I forgive you. Like, you when somebody read the script, did did they go like, well, well, why? Why is Come any of this happening? <laughs> Literally. Come out, pretty girl. Wait, why does it come out I, and play, I, pretty girl? He didn't. What? The subtitle Where said "Come she? out and play, pretty girl," but I'm pretty sure he just said "Come out, pretty girl." That's what I heard. Ding, ding. Wrote these ding, ding. <laughs> Little girl. <laughs> Come out to play. He's got the. He's got like the three flutes. Boom. Boom. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> You know when you're playing with, with a baby and you go like this? Boom! <laughs> <laughs> they love that. Babies love that. that. That's like the Italian way to play it. Boom! Yeah. <laughs> Boom. Oh. Oh. What did she just... Thank you. What did she just do? I always try to guess in my head whose voice is doing the O's. Yeah. Oh. That's... Uh... That's Polly, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. That's Polly. Oh. Yeah. That's Tony. That's Tony. And what about this one? Oh. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> I'll do that one again. Was that two different That's people? Tony. Yes. Oh. Hey. He just gave her a shot. He said he'd be right down. Is that Tony and somebody? Yeah. And the first one's Polly, and I don't know who the second guy is. Okay. Oh. Hey. Uh, okay. Find her here. <laughs> <laughs> Christ, look at this place, will you? The Sopranos is like, you can have a conversation with an Italian man without saying anything. <laughs> it's like that scene in The Wire where they just say the word fuck. But yeah. it's like, oh, 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 hey, oh. Using only vowels. <laughs> That's my favorite scene. <laughs> hey. That one's yes, that's the best. It's that's, so good. That's really what a, that's really what acting school is like. <laughs> getting closer, getting closer, getting closer, getting closer, getting closer. Are getting we closer. in the last ten minutes of this movie? Uh, we must be. Yeah. There's still twelve minutes left. Twelve minutes. Okay. That's true. Right. How, so only how, four how, minutes left. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, exactly. How dare we count credits?
Hot cross buns and 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 cold cross buns and cold cross buns and hot cross buns and cold cross buns. And lukewarm buns and lukewarm buns and lukewarm buns. Those aren't cross. No. No. Lukewarm buns. They aren't cross. Hot cross buns is three blind mice, isn't it? Yes. Right? It's hot it's cross right. buns. Because see how they run. <laughs> how they run? Exactly. That's what my head did. And then I was like, wait, what's see how they run? And I was like, oh, three blind mice. Yeah, it's like how that the alphabet song in Twinkle Twinkle Little Star is. Yeah. What, wait, oh, what look, it's the scene song? from Austin Powers. <laughs> He's gonna go really slow. He crushed wait, that guy. Just ah. crush. A, a mill worker. I have no idea. Uh, somebody who works for the lumberyard. Oh, yeah. A lumberjack, if you will. The guy's like, I don't know how to drive this thing. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have a Class C license. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's like Shenmue all over. Oh my god. Have you seen any sailors? <laughs> <laughs> no. They shot that one on a different stock of film. Yeah. I know. Meanwhile, in the 70s. He looks so damn excited. I mean, driving a forklift must be cool. Yeah. That's true. You're basically driving a big fork. <laughs> <laughs> Who doesn't want to drive Are a big you? fork? <laughs> I mean, they have those places where you can go to pay to drive... Uh, construction equipment mm -hmm. like an empty lot. Yeah. When we have a Patreon and we cross yes. a certain threshold, <laughs> then we can raffle yeah. off uh, tickets to go to, to that to that park. <laughs> Wait, well, they, do they get to go with us? Yes. No, they just get to go by themselves. <laughs> by themselves. Uh, okay. <laughs> At night. They get to pick one of us. Yeah. They have to choose. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I can't wait until this show is famous and then people tweet like, oh, well, I think that Joe and Dan are funny, but I'm not so, so sure about Jax. <laughs> I really prefer Dan Bob. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. You know, I know that they say it as a joke, but I really wish Dan Bob were there every week. <laughs> and, then, and then you'll have somebody being like, how dare you tell me that? Dan Bob is the worst <laughs> thing that's ever happened to this. <laughs> every time I hear it, I turn it the, off. The Reddit is yeah. going crazy. Yeah. Yeah. R slash never heard of it is going crazy. <laughs> Yeah, you need to grab r slash never heard of it. Oh, that's, that's true. That's true, yeah. That's gotta already exist. Probably. There's, let's see. Today I learned that I've never heard of something and I'm telling the world that I'm an idiot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you. Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Stop hitting yourself. I'm yeah, that r slash never heard of it already exists. Whoa! Oh, you can get N H O I. Whoa! <gasps> oh no! Oh shit! He's gonna drive right into a volcano. Oh. <laughs> no! Why did we build this young lumber yard on top of a volcano? <laughs> oh, and also he doesn't know how to swim. Oh, of course not. This says, things you or others have never heard of. This sub is where you post something you or someone you know have never heard of, but may be incredibly commonplace or popular. This daddy underscore Squidward says, <laughs> never heard of Ozzy Osbourne. <laughs> wow. Yes, sir. Okay. Also... Too much... O wait, too much well Ozone five years ago <laughs> just said... <laughs> Cadbury cream egg. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. Just no. Just That's no it. Explanation. Okay. There's I, there's a flaw in this the idea for this subreddit because if you're posting about it, you have heard of it. Yes. Yep. You literally cannot post about something you have never heard of. Well, like I it, it know. It should be for like oh I've never heard of a snake having ten legs. Yeah. <laughs> you know like. like yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Like, more, it's more like, could you imagine? Right. Yeah. <laughs> I've never heard a song that's over 10 hours long. Yeah. I've never 
seen a man eat so many chicken wings. <laughs> <laughs> that he died right in front of me. <laughs> I dreamt about. Cadbury cream I egg. Kill those and Eric talked about. And he killed my daddy. <laughs> he started chasing me. I had to do it. Uh -oh. What did you pick her up? She was all by the sawmill wandering around. The old sawmill. Marion. Did 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 uh, Frankie Avalon get discharged from the mental hospital, or did he escape? He he killed the he guy. Killed the guy. <laughs> it took his clothes. Oh, that's right, he did. I forgot already. So aren't they on the lookout for him? Couldn't she just say, "Hey, that's the guy"? Yeah. Or did this all happen in one day and yeah. nobody realized he left yet? <laughs> Is he not actually dead? So they're not gonna find the body. So they're just gonna send her to the asylum. Uh, yeah. And then it's time for Blood Song 2, bloodier song. And he breaks back into the asylum so he can be there with her. Mm. Yes. Girl, it's all right, you guys. Father, I like this type of... Well, I like this type of... Yeah. <laughs> a wishing well. It's got like Love nice those. stonework. Yeah. I like a well with a good Can't roof. Get enough. A nice roof. <laughs> mm -hmm. Protects the well water from the rain for some reason. A nice peaked roof is what I really like. A good sturdy basket. <laughs> hey, basket. <laughs> or bucket, I guess. <laughs> it's a wicker basket. The Whatever. water's yeah. seeping yeah. through. <laughs> you have to pull it's it up really quickly. <laughs> <laughs> drink it, drink it, drink it, drink it, drink it. <laughs> Quick, before it all falls out. I should have just said busket, I guess. Mm -hmm. My God, that's Bill and Night Watchman. That's good night watching. <laughs> what are you doing out here? Just do a little night watching. <laughs> hey, that's some good night watching. <laughs> hey. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> I like how there was like everybody rushed to the like, like where are you going? Go to the old sawmill. Did you hear? Somebody died. <laughs> Somebody died at the old sawmill. <laughs> Wait, so if that was going? the night watchman, Forkman. does that mean that the killer Bob wasn't in the forklift? He I'm put going. the guy that he squished into the forklift? <laughs> yes. Maybe. Yeah, see? Yep. Here yep. he is. Hey, want to hear a song? <laughs> oh no, Joe, it's me. It's me and you. Our worst yeah, our, nightmare. our worst nightmare. <laughs> oh god, I hate it. <laughs> okay, wait. This is the only movie that scared me so far. <laughs> I hate it. I hate it. Once again, it's not like she said there was ghosts or tentacle monsters or something yeah. crazy. They also found a dead body. Yes. I thank you. So we cannot get that information. Well, the body didn't match the description, so you must be clinically insane. Yeah, we are definitely gonna have to put you in the oh. place from One Flew Over the Cuckoo's oh, Nest. This is not like a like a Terminator Two situation where she's like, uh, yeah, no, there's a bomb and there's a robot from the future, and I killed the robot from the yeah. future, and you're like, all right, yeah. you're a little crazy lady. She just said there's a guy, and she has evidence that he killed the dad. Do they think that she killed the dad? Yes. There's no Dr. Monty. One flute over the cuckoo's nest. Oh! oh! <laughs> Galaxy brain over here. Brr, <laughs> brr. That was massive snap. A massive snap. That was like, like a sniper, no scope, not even looking. You shot a guy in a helicopter, in a moving helicopter. <laughs> You threaded the needle on that one. <laughs> now he's the doctor? I told you he was going to get back into this insane asylum. So this was... What is... This movie was both the first movie and the sequel. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> All wrapped exactly. up in one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It just means you only have to watch one movie. It's efficient. That's true. I know. Thank God. It means we don't have to watch a fucking second one. I like how I like how they use like the the Vincent Price laugh from the Thriller song at the end there. I know, yeah. <laughs> uh, as terrible as that movie was, uh, it wasn't that hard to get through. No. 
I was thinking the same thing. It, oh, I could. Oh, I wish read I could this. read this. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, after she went to the hospital, Marianne was diagnosed with a rare brain tumor. It's, it's like a, a coda. Yeah. yeah. Oh my god. Joey went on to become an insurance adjuster. Like it has like everybody's like. <laughs> like the Animal House style ending. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. Oh my god. Yeah, that went by pretty quick. I got this has say. no comments. No. What? D- what no. do we say? Just say no comment. <laughs> <laughs> yes <laughs> we did it well Tr- uh, Tristan Comer is going to get a rude awakening when he checks his uh, his alerts his <laughs> notifications <your> <laughs> can I like my own oh comment my I can't <laughs> hell yeah you can wait can you dislike it at the same time no no it's oh it's- man he's going to get like so many notifications somebody commented somebody <laughs> liked that comment somebody didn't like that comment <laughs> He's like, oh, I'm blowing up. <laughs> wow. Well, in lieu of that, I, I could look up like some some reviews if you'd like. Or oh, uh, uh, so in in lieu of that, let me show you the the Dream Warrior song that I was talking about. <laughs> oh yes. yes. Uh, we're gonna get a DMCA takedown yeah. thing. I know. Well, I should pause this. Oh, oh! What the hell? That glue was so thick. Yeah, it was called Elmer's Pus. This is from uh, Friday the Thirteenth Part Three. Oh, I know this song. Mm-hmm. I found. Wait, I found a review for that's on Blood, the Blood Song DVD on Amazon. That's for a different movie. <laughs> <laughs> after, after this, I have to read it to you because it's buck wild. My favorite Amazon reviews are like you're like looking at like a, a digital camera, and then like you look down and it says like this is the worst type of insulation I've ever used, and you're like, yeah. where did this come <laughs> from? Like, what? Oh. Didn't blend my smoothies at all. <laughs> You're like, what the? <laughs> yes, I want that guitar. I don't want to dream no more. No more. I was going to say, that hair is so good. (laughs) You said disrespectful wrong. (laughs) (laughs) Oh no, he's trapped in there. You fucking save him. Don't just leave him in there. He's burning alive. Okay, do we have to listen to the whole song? No. <laughs> yeah. I, just, um, I just want to give you a good example. I, I, so, okay, so a bunch of the reviews, this is some sort of, uh, it goes all the way to the top, because a bunch of these reviews are for a different movie, but they're on the, the Blood Song thing, right? Should, I pull, should so, I pull this up on the on the on on my screen, or do you just want to read them? Is it better if you just read uh, them? I just like to... I'd just like to read one okay, yeah. by a uh, Amazon user Draconis Blackthorn. <laughs> <laughs> he, he knelt down and put his cape across his body like this and, and bowed. <laughs> so uh, the Honorable uh, Judge Blackthorn presiding said, All rise. So it says, I'm not going to be able to read this. It says, A delightful film about a composer who becomes possessed by the spirit of another composer. (laughs) What? I need to know what this movie is. (laughs) 
Another composer named Octave Baron, who was writing a symphony dedicated to Satan until his untimely death. And so the empath Marius Carnot, Ben Cross, who also played the charming continental vampiric gentleman Barnabas Collins in the oh. year 25 A.S. adaptation of Dark Shadows, um, experiences morbid visions of torture, hellfire, and sacrifice, blah, 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 blah. But then later on it goes to say stuff like, from here on out, he assumes a rather Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde demeanor and carouses with horrors and drink. Ultimately, he disappointingly stops in mid-act and ex- asks them to sing. Marius is accompanied by a witch hag named Carlotta. This is like this is like six paragraphs. I found the movie. Was it called? What like is it? Hear, if you'd like to hear of it. <laughs> yes, I would like to hear of it. Uh, is it called Symph- Symphony for the Devil? No. I, I don't oh. think so. If, if, if I found the What's... right one, it's called Hellfire. Okay. Uh, in the... Let's see. What does it say? Where's the kind of composer Octave Baron wrote a symphony for the devil as part of a satanic pact? Yeah. And his niece, his Gabrielle work... Ap- Apollinaire, is involved. What, yeah, Gabrielle Carnel. inherits the estate and discovers a symphony, but he, believing all the stories about her late uncle are nothing more than superstition, she hires the church choir director and novice composer Marius to finish the symphony. In the process, Carlotta, now an old woman and secret oh. practitioner of witchcraft, is contacted by his master spirit from hell, who directs her in how to bring him back in the body of Marius. Marius, possessed by Baron's evil spirit, murders two women for, quote, inspiration to finish the symphony, while Carlotta secretly what? helps him to escape and, and create alibis. What oh year is God. this movie? 1995. See if we can find How a trailer. How is this? There's a trailer. Hellfire. Blood song. Oh, there you go. That's, That's why. why. But some of the reviews are for the one we just watched. <laughs> In I'm the place of evil, in the times greatest composer was put to death. Oh, they dragged him apart. Wild now, horses. Unlocked after a century. Yeah. His masterpiece lives again. Huh? You hired me to complete a symphony glorifying the devil. Oh, look at this. Yeah, because like more more than one of the reviews on Amazon was like, I love this Frankie Avalon movie. So position time this world and the next. Oh, a sword fight? Miguel and Tulio. Tulio and Miguel. In the darkness there is no mercy. This whole blood is you. Is you. Oh, she had a crossbow! Beverly Garland and Ben Cross. Music. <laughs> who? Ben Cross. Am I supposed to know who that is? Whoa! He was on fire! Wow, I wish we had watched this. Wow, and then a whole house explodes? Doug Wirt. Way to give away the ending. Yeah. You know, that didn't tell me anything about it being about composers and being no. possessed and... Um, oh, so Not so we're coming up on our 20th episode spectacular. For that yeah, one, yes. we should just watch trailers. Oh, yeah. that would be good. Or we could watch trailers to movies that we've researched. Like on yeah, like okay. kind of heard of it, but just yeah. the but trailers. Just the trailers. Yeah. 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 Yeah, that would be really fun. I'm in. And then for yeah, every like ten. Every yeah, every time we do like a, a, we'll do. a, a different format. Yeah. Yes. All right. Check out our t-shirts. Go, Amazing. Go to neverheardofit.bias. Yes. Our t-shirts, our pins, our mugs. We got... Our socks. We got tote bags on there, but they're not Never Heard of It themed, but we still got tote bags. Right. You can carry all your stuff inside. Use it to wrap Christmas presents so you're not wasting paper. Yes. Oh, uh, where does... And then the person gets a bag to take it home. Where does this yeah. rank on our list? Oh yeah, crap! Oh uh, my god, um, okay, pretty what, high. What's what's like? Start from the top. I just start reading. Uh, I, yeah, I don't know if it's top five, but I don't think it's bottom five. No. All right, so here so. The, I'll pull up the full list. But I, the top five are Contamination, Rock and Roll Nightmare, Black Roses, Scared to Death, Evil Speak. I would probably put it below Evil Speak. Yeah. What's what's beyond? That? Uh, I'm looking it up. Uh, so okay, so 
evil speak. Because it wasn't, the plot wasn't like as funny as evil speak, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. but it also wasn't like it wasn't hard torture. to watch like yeah. Death Ship. Yeah. Yeah. All right. So uh, evil speak is five and then hell high, video dead, jaws of Satan, Lords of the Deep, Funeral Home, Nightmare on the 13th mm. Floor, Phobia. Wait, what was what was Lords of the Deep? Lords of the Deep was the Roger. <laughs> that Corbin was the one, one with, with Toby. Yeah, with Toby with the computer, and then it was like the Stingray. They were underwater. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I would say, I would say, is this? I I think it's somewhere around that Jaws of Satan area. Uh, yeah. Personally, be- okay. So let me ask you this: better than Video Dead? Ah, mm, uh, maybe. Yeah. Ah. Yeah. Just because, again, Video Dead was a great, like, the plot was funnier and stupider, but it was a little bit more like, oh my God, what? when is this over? It, yeah, it dawdled yeah. for too long. Yeah. yeah. When the guy had the world's smallest chainsaw. He's like, I'm playing the world's <laughs> smallest know. chainsaw. <laughs> yeah. I, yeah, maybe. And what was above Video Dead? Hell High. No, this is not better than Hell High. Okay. No. 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 So what does that make this number seven? Number seven. Nice. Not bad. Not yeah. bad. Yeah. What did what was um Toxic Zombies? Did we say that was worse the worst one? Toxic Zombies is yes. now the the worst one, yes. Yeah. Okay, cool, cool. That was by that I I'm not lying when I say that I think that may be the worst movie I have ever watched. <laughs> I think so too. <laughs> I was thinking about it all week, and I was just like, I don't, I don't, what did we want? I remembered the commercials more than I remembered the movie. That's true. Yeah. Well, the goal is to so, find one that's worse than that. Oh, my God. Yes. Now we, that's, like, that's, our, that's our Moby Dick. That. Is the movie worse <laughs> the than Toxic Zombies? <laughs> oh, my God. The White Whale. Amazing. Actually, I actually think I... Another... Do I have... What? Uh, oh, I thought I did... I thought I had a, um, uh, a, a a line from the Moby Dick movie in my. Uh, in, why would you? Have because that? I used it on the on the on our other podcast, Popcorn in a Movie. Oh yes. Uh, was it, it was it like the one sentence in the book that's like six pages or whatever? <laughs> yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. It's just a guy saying it the whole yeah. thing. <laughs> uh, no, it was like uh, I stab at thee, or whatever the line is. Uh, oh. Yeah. Uh, no, I don't have it. Oh, no, that's terrible. I don't have it. <laughs> <laughs> What's that from? Uh, that's from a, a video of a guy lifting weights and then uh-huh. his knees like fold inward. Oh, no, 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 <laughs> and the guy no, keeps, no. And that's just, like, keeps going, oh, no, that's terrible. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, and they keep showing it on replays. Like, oh, I don't yeah, think we course. can show that. Of oh, I know. Oh, no. Oh, I know. Oh, no. That's terrible. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. I hate that. Uh, all right. Uh, <laughs> all right. So, until next week, shave. 17 weeks. Shave them off. <laughs> shave them off. <laughs> Shave them off. Shave them off, everybody. Shave them off. Bye. Bye. Never heard of it, that biz.